Hello, it's Markus from the 3D Racing Garage. Today I'm in my caravan and uh, I made uh, an adapter for the 12 volt DC power supply from Dometic. As you can see here, the adapter is plugged in in this rail and um, it's a 3D printed part and it's kind of bayonet uh, called part and I will show you how to print it and uh, which parts you need to make this adapter so why I made this adapter well I want to mount a little vent here in this roof window and uh, it needs 12 volts so it comes handy to use this 12 volt rail from Dometic to get the power from without any drilling or uh, such other mess with cables. So here you can see the two printed parts, the base part and uh, the bayonet part and um, yeah, you glue these two parts together and uh, depending on which cable you want to use you have widen these holes a little bit. For my first testing part I have used uh, some um, desoldering wire as you can see here. This time I will use some uh, real wire and um, for this case you have to widen the holes in the base plate a little bit and I use this tool, it's a body reamer from Arseca Racing so it's a really handy tool normally used to make holes in the body of, from the RC cars So use super duper glue of your choice. So. To get some additional strength with the super glue I use this um, super glue powder at the side of the connection. A little mess with this powder. It goes everywhere but where it's needed. Then just a drop of super glue and done. So this time I will use a, a proper wire instead of the desoldering copper. So I connected the wires into the part and uh, now I have to glue the wires onto the upper bayonet part. As you can see here. are connected and glued to this upper part so um, 
you can rotate it easily in the power rail and also of course to prevent a shortcut So here's the finished part with the glued in wires and um, yeah let's see if it works. So mission accomplished. I installed the adapter and it works fine. So here's the vent 